Hey guys, uh, today's hymn from home is called Abide With Me. Yes, um, this hymn was written by Henry Francis Light. He lived from 1793 to 1847. Um, he was a minister in England, and there are two stories surrounding like the history of when this hymn was written. Um, some people say that he wrote it in 1820 um, when he visited a friend on his deathbed, and the friend was like constantly just saying, abide with me, abide with me. So I think that it really impacted Light, and he said that he wrote the hymn immediately after and then gave it as a gift to this man's family. Um, and then some other people, including his own daughter, um, think that he wrote the hymn in 1847, um, kind of upon his own deathbed, just a few weeks before he died. Um, he was said to have remembered that experience prior in 1820 with his dying friend, um, and that like that's what reminded him um, of the, the words, abide with me, and, um, and then that he wrote the hymn 30 years later, essentially. Um, but either way, it was like a very impactful time that he had with his friend. Um, which kind of led to him writing the hymn. And the hymn actually was pretty hard to arrange. So the first time I heard about it was when the viols took place in this hymn, Christina Wong, she suggested this hymn. And so I listened to it for the first time. And I think what was difficult is that the words are very deep and meaningful and impactful. And the melody is very simple. It's still a great melody, but it's just very simple. So trying to figure out a way to bring out the depth and emotional impact of the song while still keeping the melody there was kind of a challenge. Um, but I think the music can kind of reflect our experience of abiding with the Lord. It starts like deep and foreboding and dark, which kind of can be our experience in life. We might go through the darkest of times, but then towards the end, the music opens up and it's this glorious thing and eventually is just restful and peaceful. And the last verse, it sort of reflects in the, the last verse here, our abiding with the Lord can eventually bring us when, to a point where heaven's morning breaks and earth's vain shadows flee. In life, in death, O Lord, abide with me. So we're going to turn it over to our violist, and she's going to talk a little bit about her inspiration behind suggesting this hymn. Hi, everyone. My name is Christina Wong, and I'm the violist on the recording of Abide With Me. I just wanted to take a moment to share with you um, the inspiration that came behind choosing this song and also the encouragement that I found personally um, in the lyrics of this song, and I hope that it will um bring some encouragement to you as well. Back in March of 2020, I approached Julian um, after seeing a lot of the Vios Project music videos, um, approaching him to collaborate on, an, on a song together. Um, I had really missed the Cleveland Heights Church community that I was a part of for many years, and I was very eager to just do something creative with everyone. And Julian asked me to send a couple of suggestions, and we chose this song. Um, this song was close and dear to my heart at the time. I had just finished a jam session of this song with my brother, and also just the words caused me to reflect deeply on just what was going on in the world, um, what was troubling in my own heart, and, um, and the music brought a lot of comfort to me, as I hope it does to you. So I just wanted to go ahead and read these lyrics to you so that you can hear the sort of depth of what the composer was thinking and um, writing. These are the words. Abide with me, fast falls the even tide. The darkness deepens, Lord, with me abide. When other helpers fail and comforts flee, help of the helpless, oh, abide with me. Swift to its close ebbs out life's little day, earth's joys grow dim, its glories pass away. Change and decay in all around I see. O oh, thou who changest not, abide with me. I fear no foe with thee at hand to bless. Ills have no weight and tears no bitterness. Where is death's sting? Where grave thy victory? I triumph still 
if thou abide with me. Hold thou thy cross before my closing eyes, shine through the gloom and point me to the skies. Heaven's morning breaks and earth's vain shadows flee. In life, in death, O Lord, abide with me. I hope that as you listen to this recording, you'll reflect on these words and that it will be a source of encouragement for you during these dark times.